What's up, guys? So we already went to our first destination, of course. Uh, I didn't anticipate that kind of uh, drag. Uh, we went to Spirit Halloween, which is like they just pick a location that's o open and they just go and set up there. Uh, I only got like one little five second clip and it was just of a figurine. That was it. I mean, it wasn't even worth stopping around because there's so many people. Um, I have a visitor. Of course, I told y'all he would be with me. Um, so we're going to go ahead and see what else we can find. Uh, not really what I anticipated at Spirit Halloween. It was pretty much all the same stuff, of course, but just different figurines. That was really it. Um, so our next destination, we'll pick it up when we get to decide where that is. And I'll let y'all know. Start then. All right. So we made it to Walmart, and um, they already put up 25% off of stuff, guys. Holy smokes. Uh -huh. If you think I'm lying, there you go, 25% off. Which, they're not much in here right now. A lot of it is well picked over. I mean, unless you want your general costumes and such. Hey, hey, copyright. It's the Sanderson sisters. Hello. Aw, how cute. Hey, uh, something wrong with your eyes, dude. Jack o' lanterns, anybody? Hm. Oh, wait a minute. Hey, hey, yeah. Roll tide. There's some candy. Yeah, this is very well picked over, guys. I'm surprised. Huh. Is this considered 25% off done? Wow. That, 25% off. Wow. Cha -ching. Chucky. Okay. I will stop right here and then I'll see if there's anything else to look at, guys. As you saw, there was barely much for the Halloween section because they spent $900 billion on their Christmas section. This is just one aisle already. Already October 19th, full of Christmas. You want a jukebox? They got jukeboxes. Like, I'm not even joking. This is just one aisle. They're still working on the whole garden center, which I have a few things I'm gonna get in here anyway when Christmas does importantly happen. Like, come on, y'all. It's not even November yet, and you're putting out Christmas. Christmas. This is sad. And you thought I was joking, folks. It is nothing but Christmas already. Just Christmas. 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 They care about one holiday in this whole forsaken world, and it's Christmas. What about the important holidays, too? Halloween, Thanksgiving. No, Christmas is the most important holiday. You need your lights? You need your twinkling lights? You want to look like Clark W. Griswold's house? Here you go. There's icicle ones. Oh. You got your big fat ones from like the 1970s and 50s and whatever era. Oh, 
Oh, you got your wrapping papers. Oh, and you come down here, and they got more wrapping paper. So you can spend millions of dollars on gifts. And your Christmas trees, guys. I'm not even joking. This is all just Christmas stuff. This is all they care about is Christmas. Halloween is pretty much a dying holiday because nobody shows no any, any enthusiasm for it no more. Yeah, you can still get you uh, a couple grills, though, before the time's over with. I'll say that. I wasn't sure what to make of this vlog because there was not much to vlog, except now. I know what the vlog. Halloween, dying holiday. Christmas is taking over. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys, I'll cut it from here and I'll talk to you guys in a little while. Okay, guys, we're at the last stop of this uh, Halloween fiasco, if you want to call it that. We're at Home Depot. And it's very, very slim still. I guess you get that kind of idea when it's limited for how much time Halloween has. I mean, it's still got some stuff to go through. Not a whole lot, but I mean, it's decently picked. So, I mean, it's all that wall there. <coughs> some of this stuff out here. Pretty funny. <laughs> oh, that is so cute. <laughs> so yeah, this is not a very good place to pick Halloween stuff for right now. So I will catch you guys up later because there is not much. Their whole other section is just Christmas stuff. That's it. That's all it is. It's just Christmas. Pretty bad. There's not much to show you guys. So. All right, guys, so we just got out of Home Depot. We did get some things. Um, we just wanted, they didn't have very much. Like I was trying to show you guys, but really there was not much to show you. The whole other section was Christmas already. It, everything was just jam packed full of Christmas. I'm pretty sure that's where the Halloween stuff was originally anyway. And then they just had all the all regular garden stuff out there and just waited for the Christmas time to start rolling in and then they just swapped everything to Christmas. But where Halloween was, that's where it probably just was anyway. So we got what's called a howling bone dog, I guess you want to call it. And then a uh, a gravestone to go along with the dog because, I mean, the dog's dead. So, I mean, and it howls and perfect combination. So, uh, so from there, I think we're going to just call the vlog it for today. Um, I want to thank Andrew for joining me on this ride. Uh, he's a part of it. He's behind the scenes, giving me ideas and stuff like that. So, whatnot. So, <laughs> um, but he will be, you know, popping in every now and then, not like every time, but like he's got his own thing going on. So, it'll be mostly just me. Um, so, tomorrow's vlog will be uh, what I did a couple months back, except this time it'll be 15 spooky kids friendly movies tomorrow so tomorrow's vlog will go up right away after i'm done it'll be a one take vlog it'll be 15 movies that are okay for kids to watch during this spooky season so if there's some ideas that you might want to throw out there for your kids to watch there you go some of them may be a little bit eh i'll go over them because it'll be a little bit more detailed vlog than this one is so this one was kind of a, a, a hit and a miss at the same time because, I mean, we still got a couple weeks before Halloween actually hits. And there's barely, yeah, a couple weeks. And there's barely any stuff out anymore. Like, nobody's putting out hardly anything anymore days. It's all Christmas and I really think Valentine's Day is bigger than Halloween sometimes nowadays. Like, they just don't put enough out. So, we'll see what happens next year. Only time will tell. 
But we did do one thing I was wanting to check out. And uh, if you guys are still looking for any physical media, there's only two places now allowing physical media to be sold at. That's Walmart and Barnes and Noble. And Barnes and Noble was not on my radar until I found out from another YouTuber when he told me about it. Target is no longer doing any physical media. They're done. They're just like Best Buy. They're boycotting any physical media, which I disagree with because at the end of the day, a physical media is your copy. You can keep it forever. A digital copy can be yours for so long, maybe the company loses the rights for it. That's what people don't understand sometimes is that the physical media is yours. They cannot come in your house and take it. A digital copy, someone can lose the rights to show it, just like Netflix. They lose stuff every time. They don't have always the rights to show everything. So a movie may pop up, a movie may disappear. It's the same principle when you buy a movie on digital. A movie is not yours forever on digital. So just keep that in mind as we move away and further and further away from digital. So... That's all I got for this vlog, guys. I hope you have a great rest of the weekend, a great start to your work week, and I will see you guys tomorrow in tomorrow's vlog. Catch y'all later. Peace.